Hello everyone, it's Alex or the Monkey Pickler here. And today, um, the uh, RSI ship sale has officially started. So it is the 2949 Citizen Con was yesterday, as you all may know. And so today kicked off the um, free fly event and um, ship sale. So let's just start with the ship sale. So if you go onto the RSI website and you click on the first link, um, Let's go IE2049. It'll load up. And you can come in, you can watch a video that will um, pretty much explain the day. Today is Anvil. Anvil, um, there are usually military ships, and but their big ship of the year is the Anvil Carrick. The Anvil Carrick has gone up in price to $500 and has been pushed back to February, which is kind of ridiculous in my opinion. But um, its Pisces was announced, and you can buy the, one of the two variants to the Pisces. The base Pisces snub, as described here, will um, be sold with the ship. It does not include the um, turret, but um, if you want to get buy it separately, you have to buy the Explorate, the C80, C8X Pisces Expedition version. It comes with a different livery, as well as a turret on top that houses two size ones. So that gives you um, four size ones as well as four SU of cargo. The it comes currently in um, LTI, War Bond, which means you have to buy it with store credit. And there is a War Bond starter pack. So if you're looking to get into the game, um, you can get the starter pack for five dollars off with lifetime insurance, which means you'll never have to pay for insurance. And it's only fifty-five dollars, which is ten dollars more than a base starter pack for like a Mustang Alpha when it's comparable in stats but carries much more cargo it has a working cargo bay it has a ramp and it's just much more utilitarian and can house two people unlike the Mustang Alpha or um, Aurora so much better deal than those two um, if you're looking to get into the game uh, I'll show you how to get into it in just a moment um, my referral code will be on screen I think at some point um, or in the description below either one so, um, back to this. <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, the other stuff you can buy on this Anvil Carrick page, the Carrick... Oh. If you if you have a Carrick already, and you would like to get the Pisces, there is an upgrade kit for $20, which upgrades the original Pisces to the Pisces... Um, uh, with a turret. I think it gives it... It keeps the... Um, Includes the original silence. It, it comes with the um, original insurance of your Carrick. So if you don't know, all insu the the insurance this year is ten dollars, or ten years, not ten dollars. It's ten year insurance this year. It went up from seven, which was last year. So pretty much at this point, don't buy LTI. This up, um, you don't have to buy LTI tokens anymore. Um, get what ship you want now. Just get it ten year insurance it'll be just the same. <laughs> it's probably longer than the lifespan of the game. Don't at me. Um, so that's that. Um, all other Anvil ships are on sale. If we come here, you can check them all out. This is still on that 2949 page. You can buy the Pisces in War Bond or non War Bond. You can buy the War Bond starter pack, which in my opinion is a great deal. Get it if you're gonna get into the game now. That's perfect time to get into the game. Gladiator, Hawk, Ballista, Arrow, and Hornet, Sunshift, all the Hornets, all the Terrapin, Valkyrie, um, and Hurricane. Um, of all the ships currently, the only ones I would probably get would be a Crucible, a Carrick, or a Pisces. Um, I personally wouldn't buy Fighters. I think Fighters are a bad deal. You're paying $200 for something that can only fight, can't really carry anything, do missions. The Valkyrie, I would say, would be good ship. It's a great ship. However, at three hundred seventy-five dollars, it's very expensive. I'd say, I wouldn't pay more than three hundred for it. The Crucible, though, at three fifty, as it's the only real salvage ship that's going to be, or not salvage, but repair ship that's coming to the game currently. I think that would be a great deal. It's going to go up in price. If you want to know a ship that's going to go up in price, it's the Crucible. Even if you just buy it and refund it, it's fine. 
So today is Anvil, tomorrow will be RSI. I'll be sure to co cover that. Um, that means Constellation Phoenix will probably go on sale tomorrow. If you're looking to get the Constellation Phoenix, get it tomorrow. Um, what else we got here? More ships. And, okay, I'm going to show you guys how to get um, the... If you want to get into the game right now, um, say you want to... There's a free fly event going on right now. Anyone can fly any ship in the game. To do that, you come here. You click on the IAE. Oh, wrong one. Go back. Why did I have to change? Anyway, you can just come here. You go to the main page, the IAE page. Um, you click fly free. You can either buy a starter pack. Um, don't buy this pack. Buy this pack here. It you you'll I'm guarantee you'll enjoy this pack if you buy this one. They have the same amount of guns I think. I think this one even has better guns. I'm not don't don't quote me on that though. And then you click download now. So you come here. This is what you need to play the game right now. Um, you can all you have to do is enlist and sign in. You click enlist now. You pick your name, your password, email address, and then handle community moniker and then you can enter a referral code um, referral codes give you extra UEC in game you get 5,000 UEC and if you want a referral code here's my referral code it might be on top of screen I don't know but it's star XVCP ZZ 6 6M and that should allow you to make an account and then the free fly event right now allows you to just to play the game even without a game package you should be able to I'm pretty sure right now, um, unless they lied to me. <laughs> but yep, you can fly free, and I'll show you once you get in game. I'll show you how to get the ships for free. Um, okay, well I'm gonna transfer over to the game now, and I'm gonna show you guys how to rent ships for free during the sale. Okay, everyone, we are now in the game. So during this event, you will spawn on. Uh, in area 18 in your hab unless you've left area 18 um, then you won't spawn here but everyone should be spawning here you leave your room uh, we have to get down to the expo floor let's just run run oh there's someone here waiting just go into here must be someone doing their free fly oh or you, I guess you can knock me around dude Oh, let's go. And we come down here. Run, 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 run. We gotta find the the train station now. And if I can remember correctly, it's right down, 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 down. Here. Right over here. Right over here. Down here. And then when you get to the train station, go to zone 2, which is on the left, I think. Maybe it was zone 1, I don't remember. But, um, yeah, we went the wrong turn. Okay, that's fine. This is fine. If I remember, this is the correct way. If not, I'm being really, really dumb. This looks familiar. I'm just trying to find the train station, which is over there. Okay. Sorry about that, everyone. I am not very good with directions. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> Here, past the cool reflections. Over here, here we go. Man, I'm dumb. If you look up, this is the transit station. Man, I knew it was a turn. <gasps> okay, you go down the transition, you take a left. I knew it was a left. Go left. This will take you to the expo. Come down here. And oh oh it's about to leave. 
five seconds. Oh, we made it on. It should go. Oh, there's someone on here. They're an AI, I think. That hurts a player who looks pretty snazzy. Okay. So, oh, you can come in, look around. It's a pretty nice, beautiful city. <laughs> um, and it should, I think it's about a minute. It's about a minute ride to the convention center. Just waiting, waiting, waiting. We're almost there. I think we're approaching it. That's it. Yeah. Approaching the convention center. Make sure you all have updated your game to 3.7.2, by the way. You're required to have 3.7.2 to play. And we're pulling up on the expo. You see, nice beautiful signs. Today is Anvil. Today is Anvil. Tomorrow will be RSI, then I think Consolidated Outland. If you're looking to pick up Pioneer, you to go on Consolidated Outland's day. So, you get off. Run, 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 run. The expo. I think you can buy special clothing here. Yeah. Today you can buy anvil t shirts and baseball caps and stuff. And you. People just standing here. Did I go to the wrong door? No, it's an elevator. That's a good poster. Alright, and Expo Hall Day 1. <laughs> they literally just have halls on top of each other. They don't even change out the ships each day. They just open up a different hall. It's kind of ridiculous. Pretty simple, too. Everyday clothing prices at everyday prices. Just gotta wait for, wait for the elevator. Look at your character. And you <sighs> wait for the loading screens to load. Maybe spam the button a little. And oh, there we are. So you'll open up into this big hall. If you remember from last year, um, I think the last year's one was in Hurston, so it's a little different. But it's a very similar setup. You come in, all the ships are here. Every single anvil ship except for the F7A and the F8. Sea Lightning are here. And what you'll see is if you run up to a ship and hold F, it'll say rent. So let's say we go back to the ballista. Well, we jump up here. Come here, ballista. Want to buy it? You can click rent. And now you can fly. Now, if you go. Oh. Now, if you go into the ship terminals on the hangar bays. Um, you should be able to spawn into it now. If you look over here, we got the Pisces. The normal version, not the um, other version, which is a little weird. You can come inside this one, check it out, Pew, sit down, maybe even fly it, I don't know. But, um, rent it. Let's say I want to rent another one. It says placeholder. Boop. Buy that. Rent it. You can rent whatever you want, and I think they're flyable for the entire event, if I've heard correctly, or they're flyable till tomorrow, but I'm pretty sure they're flyable for the whole um, event. Oh, I want one of these. Rent that. And then, say you want to look in the back of the Anvil Valkyrie. This is one of my favorite ships in the game. I really do like it. It's like a dro it's a drop ship. It's how I envision a drop ship. This is what I wanted the Redeemer to be, but it's just expensive. So I don't want to buy. I don't want to. It's only got like 10 SU of cargo too, so it's not that. It's just not very good <laughs> for the money. Like it's a good ship. Like it's super powerful. It's just not a good for the money. Anyway, um, so that's the ship sale. If any of you want to get the game, again, my referral code, sorry for being such a shoe-in today, but it really does help me. It gets me free ships. Um, so if you use my referral code, it'd be greatly appreciated. Um, and I hope you guys all had an amazing day. Um, Tip to see you guys all next time. Have, uh, have fun in the verse. 
try out some new ships and buy what you want or just don't buy anything it doesn't matter but bye see y'all soon